Hey guys, welcome back. Today we got a very, very special guests on the show. Today we have Miss Robin Rihanna Fenty and also Rakim at the Lasting Mayors. Welcome them to the show. These two are new parents, should we say, of new bundle of joy, a little boy, they say. Now, I, ha I, I don't know if it's been confirmed or not, but we definitely know their parents, okay? You know, and they say it's a little boy, so I'm sure sources would not lie about that. So, I'm so happy for them because Rihanna seemed like the perfect mom for a little boy. And I would think Re um, ASAP would be also happy for having a son. You know, it's always something great about having a son first. But, you know, it just is. Firstborn son. And he was born first. So, um, we don't know the name. I don't know the name in a way. I don't know if you guys know the name. But we're going to just check in the energy of what's going on with these two. Are they lovey-dovey? You know, how's it going being new parents for these two? So, we're going to jump straight in. So, give me the best cards from this deck, Divine Angels, for Rihanna and her boo, Rakim. Baby daddy. Um, you know, the father of her newborn son. Rakim, what's the current energy? What is the current energy? Let's see what wants to come out. Okay. A lot wants to come out so far. So let's just pick it up and just read, honey. But, you know, when it comes to ASAP, a lot going to always come out. ASAP on talk, okay? You best believe it. So I just, I love it. I let ASAP talk. Because he don't mind doing it. ASAP, um, yeah, his energy is always very talkative. So the first thing we have here is some type of achievements here that's going on with these two. So... There's some achievements. It's like, I'm seeing with this card that's, you know, working. I know they're not, they, sh they may be receiving some type of achievements or some type of awards, okay? Or she just feeling like she just achieved a lot by having the babies, okay? But we got the birds and it's like the show birds are watching. So it's, it's feeling more career-like though, okay, when it comes to achievements. So she may be receiving some type of achievement soon or some type of award. Then we got some type of financial loss of isolation. Now, I hope she's not stressed out because she, you know, just had the baby. She worried about getting back out there making money. But we got the poverty card out here with the authority card, okay? This speaks of a father figure or this can also be some type of public authority. But um, it's feeling like a father figure. So it seems like we got achievements here and there's some type of isolation. She may be feeling isolated, you know, with the, with the baby. I don't know. But we do have ASAP showing up as a father, as the father figure or some type of authority. Then we got the start here. Lord, it looks like somebody leaving the nest. But but it seems like there's a new start for them. So it's like fatherhood is a new start for them. They feel like this this the baby is an achievement, okay? Even though she's taking a moment to, because she just literally had the baby. She probably already feel like she needs to get up and work. But I hope she don't. I hope she... You know, if you got a billion dollars in the account, you can sit down for a minute. Come on, sis. So, um, but ASAP is showing up as the father, as a father figure. You know, this is something new to him. This is a new beginning to him. He may not even have, um, you know, roots to kind of te to go by because it seems like he kind of scared about it. But it's a new start, and he's very curious and happy about it. It's like he's curious about this new fatherhood role, and he's trying to learn. It's like he's going in head first, even though. You know, some people like no, oh no, ASAP, you can't, don't hold the baby like this or this. But he going straight and he's very curious. Okay, it's 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 almost like he taking the lead when it comes to the baby. Okay, almost overconfidence. <laughs> I, yeah, I'm seeing ASAP showing up as being very overconfident. Okay, when it comes to um, even the fatherhood, because this right here is the, a major father role right here. This like coming in strong as a father. Okay, uh, and maybe even look of confidence, and Rihanna probably be looking at him like, "Boy, you don't know, you don't know, you don't know what you're doing, ASAP. Stop it." 
but it seems like when ASAP got the golden touch, probably when it comes to the baby. I feel like he got the golden touch when it comes to the baby. And Rihanna looking at him sideways. <laughs> Little Junior is, you know, but there's some searching here, okay? So, they both are learning. They both are trying to learn, you know. They don't, you know, they new parents. But it's a lot of hope and love in the house. It's a lot of hope and love. Okay, because it's like they're looking for it, when, especially when it comes to love. It's like they're looking for it when it comes to love and their family together. There's a lot of hope here. And it looks like ASAP is looking at Rihanna leading the way when it comes to the relationship and love. It's like he's leading the relation. He's leading the way when it comes to being a father. Which is... It's not surprising to me because it seemed like he would. But... Because his last reading was showing that he was focused on the baby. Like his attention was focused on baby. And I'm seeing that now. But when it comes to relationship, Rihanna is making sure that that's staying on point. You know, he's still kind of, I don't know if he's skeptical because somebody down here holding a, a rock as a heart. Okay, but it's like he's still, there's still hope when it comes to this relationship. And, and it's, and I have to feel like the baby is, is starting a new start for them. The baby is bringing in a new start for some, you know, and then, and they looking. It's like, almost like I'm seeing Rihanna looking towards ASAP, kind of leading the way as a father. And she impressed by that. So she kind of see her destiny. She see, you know, hope and destiny with him. You know, she see that, you know, things are finally working out for them. You know, you know, she probably looking at, you know, things are finally working out for them this time. This time she see hope and, you know, she see this being a positive relationship. But there is some still some anxiousness here. Okay, it's still some stuff that's in the shadows that's still kind of creeping up on them a little bit. And it may still fall into authority. It may fall into them having some money issues. Okay. And it also, you know, because, you know, there is some little overconfidence when it comes to maybe issues, legal issues here. That still kind of creep in in the back, in the back when it comes to this relationship. Okay. Financial stability. It still shows up here. So it's like it's something in the, you know. And it's like some opportunities may even be coming up for her. Okay, she's trying to avoid it. You know, it's like she's trying to focus on the relationship and this new start with the baby. But it's some opportunities that's showing up here. And, and it's hard not to see them. So I think that's why she's feeling like, okay, I need to get out, get back out here and work. But it's like, Rihanna, just take it slow, baby. Okay, but there's some delusions here. There's still some relationship delusions that, delusions that may be here. Okay, and that also may be causing some type of an anxiety, but you know, they're gonna still stay optimistic. You know, it's a relationship, it's a relationship. Okay, relationship go through the up through its up and downs. You just have to realize who do you who are you willing to go through life with? Life gonna have up and downs. Who you who are you willing to go through this roller coaster with? And it's up to the two people to decide, okay, I want to go through this roller coaster coaster with you Rihanna and Rihanna say okay I want to go through this roller coaster with you ASAP or Rakeem and so and they're still being motivated and they, they money motivated okay they money motivated there's some motivation motivation here that's still being guided here with money so there's still some money come opportunity that's coming in okay education they still learning of course being new parents they still learning okay and they may even be coming together spiritually Okay, it's a lot of it's a spiritual connection here. So it's a lot of hope with this relationship right now. It's a lot of positive energy. They looking at each other as destinies, like they really focused in. Okay, there is still some shadows that's creeping in in the back that they're dealing with, especially when it comes to authority. And it may be standing in the way of ASAP being a father. It could take away from him being a father if things don't go right. Okay, but it's like if he. If they stay spiritually grounded, because at the end we have this, there's a spiritually grounded. If they keep some type of morals and a foundation, a, a, not just a financial financial um, stability, but also a spiritual um, foundation, that they can really. There's a lot of hope and optimistic at the end of this relationship, a new start when it comes to this relationship. But like I said, it's still kind of like in this area, it's still some delusions. Be shown a little bit. I still show ASAP. Okay, yeah, there's just some anxiety and delusions here. So let's find out. So 
what's going on okay we got the knight of pentacles that wants to come out but let's see what's going on with this authority card why is the authority card here for asap and rihanna why is the authority card here okay we got the hangman getting stronger in oneself a lot of deliberation and delaying in life okay so it's like somebody got some time to um think here as you know it seemed like if this is asap here okay if this it seems like this kind of asap energy he really doing a lot of deliberating about his life okay good and bad very much good and bad okay um he, he's looking at what he manifested in his life with this card okay that's and it's like manifesting some anxiety here so it's like he looking at his life and reevaluating especially looking at his new son because in his son it's like he's starting to see life differently through his son and that happens okay give me more about this anxiety why is this anxiety here Okay, the Knight of Pentacles speaks of a young man of 25 years old with a message to share. It seems like um, we got a knight coming in. Okay. Yeah, we got a knight coming in. Somebody with a message to share. Some type of masculine energy coming in with, with something to share, something to say to um, a man over 25. Look like has something to say to ASAP. Okay, no, but this speaks of a, a man with blue eyes to fair to brown hair, gentle, emotional, and shy with the Knight of Cups. Hmm, give me more about the Knight of Pentacles and the Knight of Cups. Okay, it's got the two, the Four of Cups in reverse. Speak, okay, I'm speaking about some money. It's, it's like somebody coming in, it's like a Knight of Masculine Energy, maybe a young masculine energy coming in. Okay, with a message concerning a money situation to this Knight of Pentacles, Knight of Cups. Give me more about this Knight of Cups. Okay, we got the Knight of Wands. Speaks of a man over 25, green eyes, blonde to red hair, restless, outspoken, and ambitious. Okay, so we I see a lot of knights here. A lot of, okay, I have the knight here. We got the king of wands, and we got the king of cups here around this four of cups, which is all around ASAP energy. And it's like money um, being offered something that you may not want, but this is in reverse. And it's like it's something that he it's something that's being offered here that he may want. Okay, let's get some details on this. Okay, I wasn't ready to be I wasn't ready to get into ASAP energy like that. With all these knights and there's a lot of passion, feelings, and money. Okay, they all in their feelings. Give me more about this current energy. Four of Cups in reverse, Knight of Pentacles, Knight of Wands, Knight of Cups. Okay. It's like feeling getting caught in the middle. Being caught in the middle of something. Okay. Like ASAP is being called in the middle of something when it comes to, yeah. Mm. We got some bitter energy right there. We're gonna have, have to tap into that later. But it's like he's being called up in the middle of something, okay, between some Xers and some millennials, young people, young people stuff. It's like a sudden mood of change, salty, feeling someone did you wrong, upset, bitter, annoyed, jealous. A lot of jealous energy of still around ASAP right now and it's like he in his head about this this is what he's thinking about right now I don't know if there's some current energy but he's very anxious about this it's a lot of stuff from the dark from the past that's coming up here okay so give me more about anxious why is this anxious energy here maybe even a salty female energy too yep I knew it I said someone else said it we got a female energy here that's a little salty too. A young woman to 25 years old. Spying, deception, reflecting. Looking back over your shoulder of a situation. Yeah, we still got a salty woman. We got some salty men. Jealous. Stealing the energy. 
Okay. And it seems like it's giving him a lot of anxieties. Okay. And, and there's some type of delusions that's here. At least right into the delusions. For the delusions. Give me more about the delusions. Frustration. Okay. Some truth coming out. A hollow victory. But it's still speaking of a hollow victory. It's like they still can't. They, like they moving forward in a positive way but it's like as soon as they take two steps forward they have to take a step back that's what i'm seeing here and especially with these group of people up here the ace have been entangled with it's like as soon as they think we we handled it it comes back again and it gives them anxiety or just the thought of them maybe coming back again is giving them anxiety so they're searching for answers and right now it looks like they turn into the the, the correct answers spiritual answers right here that's the only way you can deal with some people and then it says there's some optimism and hope here with this relationship and i hope they really do come together and conform together um and stand together you know they have a baby now so but let's see if that's that's look like it's going to happen it's like a new start here a lot of hope in this relationship give me more about this conformity in the relationship yep I knew it. Yeah, we got money, contentment, signing of a money agreement, the sun, a marriage, happiness, and brightness, prospects. They definitely are going to move forward, you know, and, and it seems like this is religion. This is more like conforming to religion, conforming to, um, to a union, pretty much, a spiritual connection with a marriage, ten of pentacles, okay? come together a money contract this is a marriage right here y'all so it's hope when it comes to this marriage if they're not already married they're about to do it okay and they're gonna have a lot of hope moving forward optimistic you know some some person is one person in this relationship a little down about it we're gonna find out who that is okay who is this op okay we got the optimistic card here give me more about the optimistic card because this person got a lot of anxiety Okay, it looks like it may be ASAP. Yeah, it's a lot of anxiety here because we got the star card. It's like karma is happening. Things are coming out. The truth are being spoken here with the moon card. The moon card is not in the reverse no more. So it's like he's speaking the truth. This, the truth is being uh, spoken here. Okay, he wants to be optimistic about it. But I think the truth kind of hurts somebody. Okay, the truth probably hurts Rihanna a little bit. I'm picking up. But, you know, she's still trying to be hopeful here. But I still see ASAP kind of down. I don't know why this. I could find out who that is, but I don't know. The truth is being spoken. The truth is coming out. Okay. They're being optimistic. Like I said, this relationship is up and down, up and down. Okay. But they are learning a lot. They're looking for a new start when it comes to this relationship. It's a typical young relationship. That's just how young people go. It's just how it go, okay? So it's not going to be perfect, and it's up to these two to decide if they're going to be together or not. It looks like they are deciding to be together. Right now, the energy is good, okay? The past is coming up to creep up through, but right now, especially with the blue, but not with the blood moon going on, now is the time to purge anything that's in your past and be truthful about it, not just for ASAP. That's for everybody, and it seems like he's purging right now. And we got a lot of salty jealousy energy that's around him, but there is some hollow victory. It's some frustration here but there's some victory moving forward with the truth okay but moving forward with the truth gonna hurt somebody with this sword this sword is gonna hurt somebody with the truth okay because there was some delusions in this relationship but it seems like they're getting past the delusions okay and in, in, in the middle of the relationship is a lot of anxiety okay a lot of jealousy and drama here but they are moving forward with a lot of hope spiritual connections okay with the marriage card with the moon card in reverse, it's like they're turning things around. They are being optimistic, okay, even though some people are kind of getting hurt in the, in the truth. Like I say, it's a hollow victory. The truth hurts. That, that just, that's just what it's saying. But there is a new start here, okay? Starting from zero again. Home sweet home. It's, get, it's like they're throwing out the garbage so that they can have a new start, okay? So they're very optimistic. So that's the energy for ASAP and Rihanna. I hope you guys enjoyed it. We'll check back in on them later on. But right now, that's the energy. I'll talk to you later. Bye.